In this video, we will go over how to construct a 90% confidence interval, or 95%, for a difference in population means with the sample statistics for mean calorie content of two bakery specialty pies and confidence interval, interval construction formula below. You can use the formula, but I'll show you how to do this using stat crunch. Okay? So you would like to go to stat crunch. Not it. Um, hold on, let me start over. Because, oh, that's what I was looking for. Question hill, stat crunch, and it's open. Uh, now, look at the second sentence, though. This is, this is where it's giving us hint on which statistics we are using. It says, assume the populations are approximately normal with equal variance. Okay? But here's the thing. They said, assume. Now, what that means is we don't know what they are, but we're just going to assume it. Okay? When you do not know population standard deviation, that's when you have to use t-stat, okay? You go to t-stat. If they tell you the population standard deviation, then you're going to do z-stat. But for this problem, you're going to do t-stat because they say assume they are blah, 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 okay? And then after that, you go to two sample and click on with summary because they gave us a summary. After that, it's easy. You just have to enter the numbers in there. So I'll go 1892. 166 tiny sample size but it doesn't matter because they did say that populations are normally distributed so and then do not click on hold on hold on maybe we should oh look it says equal variances assume equal variances when we are assuming equal variances you do want to pull variance okay if they say only equal variance don't click on pull variance all right, they do want that 90% confidence interval, so you just change that to 90% level, and that's it. Click on Compute, and here it is. So let's see how we round this. Round to nearest integer. So I'm going to round it to 115 for the lower limit, and 445 for the upper limit. 115 and 445, and that's what you do to construct confidence interval.